All right, hey guys, welcome back to another Marvel Legendary video. Today's actually not a playthrough. Um, I, I saw that this got posted, uh, so I figured, hey, let's talk about the new uh, the new preview for the new expansion for so Messiah Complex. So um, I just wanted to, I haven't looked at it. I saw that it was done up. I saw a picture of a card when I clicked on the link for this, but I haven't read through anything. I saw that Investigate's coming back based on the title as well. But I figured, hey, let's just go over it and... Um, yeah, I think this will be kind of cool to kind of just speculate and see what re what's returning. So I'll actually read it if in case you're trying to listen to this and you don't want to see the screen because I know sometimes like not that you don't want to see the screen, but maybe you, you put this on in the background or whatever. So I'll read everything. So Legendary Messiah Complex, um, Investigate, Returning Keywords, and our latest card preview. Scarlet Witch suffers a psychotic break. Due to her immense power, she decimates the mutant population by whispering three simple words. No more mutants. Mutants all over the globe lose their powers and return to the ranks of the humans. It's a race against time in an effort to save mankind, mutant kind. Sorry, the challenge ahead, uh, challenges ahead are formidable. You will be, will you be able to overcome the odds, or are the mutants on the verge of extinction? Returning to legendary and messiah complex are fan favorite X Men. So they're gonna do a Wolverine, <laughs> um, and also making a return will be X Force. Oh, that's awesome because we only have the X Force characters uh from dark city and there's only five of them um and if you can name them all uh you get a point um <laughs> um um let's see okay returning okay so it says and also making return will be x-force which will first debut uh first debuted back in 2013 with a dark city expansion but that's not all a brand new team of mutants joined the ranks x-factor investigations x-factor investigations I, I, there was nothing in between Will this ragtag band of heroes be able to unravel the mysteries and discover the key to repairing the damages and restore, restoring what was lost? As usual, let's begin with some returning keywords and legendary messiah complex. Legendary has a lot of great keywords, piercing energy, berserk, and abomination, just to name a few. But in a messiah complex, perhaps one of my personal, personal favorite keywords will be back, investigate. There's absolutely no better way to control the nasty surprises that will come out of villain deck than investigate so we're getting piercing energy which is was first done in the x-men set um if you remember that ability uh defeats villains based on art and masterminds based on their victory point score how much they're worth so it's cool to see because i think if you go back and look at the x-men set psylocke is like full piercing energy legion has a piercing energy card um phoenix has a piercing energy card polaris has one or two and i think that like i think that might be it. like it's a small handful so it's gonna be cool to see a hero or two or, or maybe maybe more will have this box will be a medium box so it's gonna be like revelation so it's a it's a 200 card box set and if that's anything to go on i'll go off of they had three masterminds um two henchmen groups um two or like i don't know two or three villain groups into the cosmos was something similar so you're yeah like three masterminds two or three villain groups two or three henchmen groups whatever like two henchmen groups three three four villain groups sorry and then like nine heroes so that's probably what we're going to be dealing with here um berserk also came from the x-men set so that's you uh discard the top card of your deck and whatever printed attack is on that card you get plus attack equal to that Abomination first came in the Captain America 75 year anniversary and then later on in the um, Realm of Kings and that's Abominations like whatever city space underneath whatever printed attack is on the card underneath in that city space um, in the HQ you get plus attack for that or the villain does and then investigate obviously we're going to talk about here first happened in Noir but then later in Dimensions so it says keywords represent X Factor investigations looking into mysteries. This keyword and searching for evidence now lies it appears in Legendary Marvel Noir and Dimensions. Some cards say things like investigate for a card that's green. That means look at the top two cards of your deck, reveal a card with green from the, from among them and draw it, put the rest back on the top and or bottom of the deck in any order. Other cards let you to escape for certain cost teams, icons, or other traits. So we've got actually, here's two heroes. We've got Strong Guy. He's that uh, X, what is it called again? X Factor Investigation. So we've got Strong Guy here. This is one of his commons. Uh, 
four, so the cost four, it's two recruit, investigate for a green and or uh, X, X, what is there? I'm, I just, X factor investigation. So X factor, I'm gonna say X factor. So investigate for a card that's green and or, so you only get one because it has a card. But it can be both. Like it's green and X factor, then it's fine. Or if it's an X factor, or if it's green, because I guess this card is green and X factor. The other one is Warpath. He's an X Force hero. Tra Grim Tracker is this card. Choose a number one or more. Investigate for a card that costs of, of that cost. So pretty straightforward. I bet a lot of his cards will be putting stuff on top of the deck or looking at stuff or whatever. He's two attack. I mean, he's two cost two and one recruit. So or he's one attack cost two. It's, oh, his his flavor text says the most dangerous prey are people, specifically Apocalypse, Onslaught, Dark Phoenix, the Sentry. That's kind of scary. Okay, anywho, <laughs> the world begins in uh, world began in chaos. Out of chaos emerged a certain order, a code, one of honor. The code has been passed through the centuries. Knights once tested their valor and noble joust. Gentlemen once took ten paces, turned and fired to settle a grievance. It still exists today. It's reflected in our second returning keyword, Chevro's Duel. So maybe these are, aren't, maybe these are just listing keywords, but these aren't the ones coming back. So, okay. So Investigate's coming back. Chevro's Duel's coming back. You have to fight. Uh, so to fight an enemy with Chevro's Duel, all the attack you spend must come up from a single hero name. Pretty straightforward. Oh, okay. So we got a villain group here. Uh, Clan uh, Yoshida. So we've got they've got chivalrous duel and then ambush choose a hero name you can't play any heroes this turn unless they are that hero name or gray heroes and then the other one is ambush the villain with the wor worth the most victory points uh captures a bystander and the city captures a bystander so pretty straightforward um but oh that's it what the heck So let's look at some st some examples here so for example to fight a three attack villain with chivalrous duel you must spend three attack from uh, different two different strong guy hero cards but you can't combine two attack from a strong guy and one from a siren so that's another hero that we're getting i think that's how you say your name siren um so that's another hero that we're getting so there's three of them that we know so far if a hero has no hero name listed like shield trooper sidekick anything uh then its hero name is the same as its card name so you can play three shield troopers with three attack but you can't spend two strong guy and one shield trooper and then you can't use attack from anything that is not a hero card, so no shards from other sets. You can use attack from a hero artifact if they are the right hero name. So pretty straightforward. Little, I like some rule clarification. But unfortunately, it looks like there's nothing here suggesting when it's coming out or anything like that. So um, we at least got our first preview here. We know three heroes, Strong Guy, Warpath, and Siren. Although we don't know Siren's name. We know of a villain group, Clan Yoshida. And we know uh, Chivalrous Duel and um, Investigate come back. So hopefully there will be a new keyword and then we'll hopefully see a mastermind or so. I still would like to have a lot of this surprise. Um, but anyway, uh, that's going to be it for today. Just a little quick video here of the new set, a preview of the new set. I'm very excited, looking forward to it. I'm excited that they're not all X-Men heroes because um, while we have, I mean, it, you know, I, I'm always going to be happy for more legendary. We had a whole big box to them. So the fact that we're getting a new hero team and more X-Force makes me very excited. Um, but that's going to be it today. Oh, excuse me. I'll catch you guys in a couple days for a uh, playthrough video. I also did a video. Or I'm not a video. I'll, I'll just do the video. I'll just I'll, I'll send that out after next week. Okay, anyway, uh, I'll, I'll see you guys on Friday. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Bye-bye.